Space pirates don't exist. After all, who would be insane enough to voluntarily leave civilization and survive entirely off of things stolen from others? Absolutely nobody, obviously. And where would they even get ships? It's not like they could just make them. They would have to steal them, which just is impossible. I guess they could get stuff from scrapyards, although that would result in a ship that's barely spaceworthy, not nearly enough to intimidate somebody into handing over their cargo, let alone take it by force. In other news, we've discovered a new species. I think they call themselves... humans? A large spaceship lay dormant next to an asteroid. Scrap metal stolen from God knows where strapped with his armour. Sharp steel jutting out from all around, as if it was covered in daggers. There was an area with more streamlined armour. However, where one would usually paint the name of their ship was instead... Only live 5th Battle Group, not Pirates. Along with a significantly smaller, technically with privateers directly underneath it. Although at first glance you may assume this ship to be a member, or former member of the Union of Man's 5th Battle Group, an elite force adept at hit and run tactics, upon closer examination you would notice the glaring inconsistencies, such as a gigantic triple barrel world breaker rotary cannon, typically used for planetary defense being used as a spinner weapon, allowing for insane firepower to be released in short bursts, along with heavy ballistic weaponry haphazardly sticking out of the sides, and point defense systems shoved wherever they could fit. It was a ship so stupid, so genuinely moronic that no sane member of any species would even think of creating such a vessel. But it worked, instantly scaring the shit out of anybody who encountered it, which made piracy operations a breeze. Oh, did I mention that the ship was originally a cargo freighter? Captain Jackass Jack stood upon the bridge of this mighty vessel, his second-in-command drunk off his ass of vodka, and his gunnery officer likely high on whatever drugs he could manage to get his grubby little hands on. That, or he was snorting the antimatter fuel used to travel through the space between universes. Incoming vessel, designated as Raytheon Sukhoi Corporate Trader, rang out of the speakers on the computer. Jack's eyes lit up. Carter! Carter, get off of your fucking ass! The drunken second-in-command, Carter, jerked up from his chair. An office chair they stole from some random guy a while ago. What? huh What? What's happening? Carter said, slowing every single word. We've got a corporate trade ship on the way. You know the drill. Get your damn station in case the fuckers have a death wish. Yeah, yeah, got it. Carter yawned, tripped on his own foot, and then fell face first onto the floor. Jack sighed. Ship re-identified as Raytheon Sukhoi Hunter Killer Battle Fleet. They appear to have used experimental and or unknown technology to conceal themselves. Came out of the computer speaker. Jack's heart stopped. Carter! Carter, get to the fucking command station or I swear to God! They aren't here for us, dumbass. We just got here a day ago and haven't had our transponder on. There's no fucking way they even know we're here. Luke, the gunnery officer, said from the door. Oh shit, you aren't tripping balls? Jack said. Nah. Run out of the good shit yesterday, Luke said. He paused, turning to look at Carter, who was now passed out on the floor. Fuck happened to him? I said he didn't have the balls to drink a sixth bottle. Oh, yeah. You know, you've really fucking earned the title jackass, haven't you? Hang yourself. Luke sighed and walked over to the gunnery station. If we stay really still, they won't notice us, Jack said. Better fucking hope so, Luke replied. A fleet of grey ships flew in formation just three light seconds away from the asteroid field, where Jack's ship was. The teal engines deactivated so as to not waste any power. Inside the flagship, a highly advanced cruiser, the Admiral sat in his chair half asleep. As such, we should be wary of any encounters with rogue derelicts, especially motherships. Rogue derelict motherships? You have to be kidding, those things don't exist, the Admiral said. You think the Union wouldn't put any more effort into making sure the AI didn't go apeshit on their biggest ships when they set them out for exploration? For God's sake, the heavy drones on that thing have world breaker rotary cannons on them. Don't they use those for mining? Yeah. The sheer firepower that thing can put out is enough to overload a battleship's shield system. Takes a hell of a long time to reload it, though. You would assume so, after all. Unidentified ship detected an asteroid appears to be dormant, rang out from the computer speakers. Ha! Looks like we get to go pirate hunting, the Admiral said. Armaments detected on ship. Two blacksmith anti-ship missile racks, one Mjolnir heavy artillery gun, three Grim Reaper point defense arrays, and several other unidentified weapons, Rescanning. Oh, this'll be easiest. 
Spinal weapon detected. World Breaker Rotary Cannon appears to be a Union Heavy Mining Drone. The room went silent as the Admiral put two and two together. Oh shit, there's a fucking mothership nearby! The Admiral yelled, and all hell broke loose. Officers scrambling to their posts in the stampede of panic. Jesus Christ, turn the fuck around, holy shit! Heavy drone is now active, caution is advised, went out over the speakers, and immediately everything got ten times worse. Admiral, Johnny just pissed himself, somebody yelled. I know, I did too, the Admiral yelled, as he frantically moved the computer mouse to the warp button. He clicked it, and instantly the whole fleet was sent to the space between universes. The fuck was that? Jack asked. Dunno, Luke said. Seems like they left. But the alarm system said they detected us, Jack said, puzzled. You really expect that old piece of shit to not malfunction at the worst possible times? I activated the ship. We would have gotten caught if... Yeah, but we didn't, did we? Luke? Yeah? I think I'm going to go drink a few bottles of vodka. You know what? What? I think I will too.